Okay, here's how to do a reset on a 300E or 500E Chromebook where the power button is on the side. So to do a reset, you have to hit the escape key and the refresh key at the same time and then press on the power key. Then let go of the power key, and then let go of the escape and refresh keys. That will bring up a screen that looks like this. It says, please insert a recovery USB stick or SD card or something similar to that. Then you do Control D. So you hold down the Control key and then the D key at the same time. The screen now says to turn off OS verification, press enter. So I'm going to hit enter. And then it's going to ask to do it again. So I hit enter again. And then it says the system will reboot, local data will be cleared. So this is erasing everything from the Chromebook and making it all fresh again. After it reboots, you are then going to have to find your Wi-Fi at your house. The first screen will be a welcome screen. You just click let's go. And then it's going to say connect to network. This is where you need to find your own network at your house. So at my house, my network is this one. So I'm going to click on it. And then I just put in my password. After I put in my password, I click connect. And it will connect. Then it asks to uh, approve the universal terms of service. And it's also going to ask, help make Chrome OS better. I usually turn this off. And then I hit accept and continue. And then it's going to ask you to enroll. To enroll, all you do is put in your Jeffco ID and password. Sometimes it will do the enrollment for you and you don't have to put in your Jeffco ID and password. In this case, that's exactly what happened. I didn't have to do that. But sometimes you do. Then you hit done. And then before signing into your Chromebook, you should shut it down. And then turn it back on again. Once the Chromebook turns back on, you should be able to just sign in like normal. And everything will work great. The very first time you log in after doing a reset, things will be a little bit slower. Because all of your apps extensions will be installing themselves in the background.